Hello, everybody. Welcome back to Let's Play Tales of Fantasia. In the last episode, Deos was resurrected, and then we lost our robot, and then we made a ton of Star Wars references, and we drank Diet Coke together. Huzzah! Let us move forward! This is very exciting already. I'm so happy. Hmm. Uh, do I want to buy items now? No. I'm going to save the buying items for later because I know we need to update our um our weapons and armor and stuff like that. Oh, what's over here? A puddle. A very big puddle. Also known as a stream. I can see my reflection. Oh, I love this game. <laughs> Everything is making me happy today. I don't know why. Anyways, well, I do know why. Look, everyone, outsiders. Who are they? Your mom. They're just kids. No, we're not. We're teenagers. Yeah. Phoenix. This looks just like home. Aw. Huh? An old man. Excuse me, where are we? <laughs> wow, strangers, where'd you come from? You didn't answer our question, old man. Well, um... Uh, I'm Phoenix. I'm from Totus, and this is my companion, Mint Chocolate Chip. We awoke just south of here, but we don't know how we got here. You sound very suspicious, you know. Totus? I've never heard of it. Anyone ever heard of a totus? Sounds like a tortoise. Uh, well? Very impatient. Good communication skills, you guys. You're not even talking it out. Hmm, sounds like my dad's going to start exercising. I must close my door. Close. Ugh, why won't it close? Yay, the door has been closed. No one seems to know anything about this totus of yours. But for some reason, I don't think you're, yes, lying to me. <laughs> Is it possible you were sent here by magic? Uh... What's magic? Seriously? It's what Min has been doing the entire time. You are such a moron. Anyways, this may take a while to sort out. Please come in and we will talk. Had to adjust my microphone. Sorry about that. Realized it was in front of my face. Anyways, follow me. Yeah, my microphone is incredibly sensitive, but I like it that way. You know, norm, no more uh, static problems. Sounds suspicious to me. Yeah! Let's check it out. Yeah! Grab your pitchforks and torches. My name is Lenios. I'm the village elder. Okay, yes, we knew that. It's nice to meet you. Lenios. I know that name from somewhere. I can't believe you've never heard of magic. Seriously. I can't believe that you don't know mana. It's the power of healing. No, it's not. What? Healing? <gasps> wow, I feel ten years younger. We didn't need to know that, dude. But I don't have a clue how you did that. So, magic is like this. Ooh, fireball! Oh! <laughs> the look on his face was so priceless. Whoa! I bet magic is the key to defeating Deos. <gasps> Defeat Deos? Not likely. You know who Deos is? Of course, Deos is the most inhuman fiend in the world. 
Every day his armies conquer more of the world. But Deos was just released. Shouldn't that be an exclamation point? Anyway. What are you talking about? Deos has been in power here for over a decade. We must be in a different time period. I thought Morrison or Tornix or whoever it was... Yeah, Tornix D. Morrison. I'm, I'm a moron. I can't remember anything. He told you he was going to send you to a different time period, didn't he? You don't pay attention. Huh? <gasps> Is this our future? No. <sighs> Seriously. No. <gasps> Look at where we are. The houses. This has to be our past. There you go, girl. You're one smart cookie. Of course! Lenios! You are the man who founded Totus! Huh? No? Future? Past? What in the world are you two talking about? This is the year 4202. 4202. Dude. A hundred years in the past? I think I'm going to faint. Oh, brother, get yourself together. Elder, look at what you did. Oops. Hee <laughs> hee. Ba da 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 da. This is amazing. I can't believe it. Visitors from our future. There's no other explanation. I know it's too much to ask for you to believe us, but please tell me more about Deos and magic. Yes, of course. Deos can only be hurt by magic. That's why Avanista and Midgard are researching it. The problem is that you can't use magic. Really? Why not? Because you're stupid. Humans can't use magic. Only those with the blood of elves can. Hmm. Elves? Well, pure-blooded elves, or half-breeds. Seriously, this is starting to sound like Harry Potter. I know that this came out before Harry Potter, but since I read Harry Potter first, I'm saying that this sounds like Harry Potter. That's the only way? Don't worry, I'm sure you can find someone who is willing to help you in the fight against Deos. Is there anyone you can think of? No. So you're really thinking about going after Deos? Yes, you can stop us. Of course, maybe that's why we were sent here. You were sent here for this purpose. Ugh. Perhaps, but... Please, we have to do something. For Tornix and Chester's sake. You're going to save that robot? Seriously. Don't do it. No. In Euclid, north of here, a man by the name of Cloth F. Lester has devoted his life to studying magic. He's a stubborn fool and may seem standoffish, though. Thanks for all your help. Yes, thank you. It really was my pleasure. You look tired. I'd be honored if you'd stay the night here. Don't do it! Oh my gosh, you remember the last time you stayed somewhere for the night? You got arrested, your uncle betrayed you, he's going to betray you too. Thank you for your kind You're all stupid! I'm about ready to hit the set. Yes, and we will hit the hay. Yeah, me too. <laughs> Howdy, y'all. Phoenix! Um, what is it? There's two of us and, um, only one bed. That's right, because Phoenix is a perv. What? You are so stupid. Uh, oh, she's blushing too, the poor thing. Oh, and now he gets it. Mm-hmm. Oh, jeez. Um, I wasn't trying. Of course not. I'll just sleep here. On the floor. Way over here. On the other side of the room. 
Dot, dot, dot. Good night. <laughs> so funny, anyway. One hundred years. Is there even a way back home? Maybe if we are able to defeat Deos here, then history will be changed so Chester and Tornix will be saved. Hmm. Phoenix, are you still awake? Yes. Tomorrow is another day. Mint is so sweet. I like her. Yeah, I guess. I'm going to be all sad and depressed now. She's so nice. And gives him a blanket and everything. <laughs> Alright, now to start anew. We are going to go on a quest. Hooray! Wait, is there anything in here? Nope. Is there anything in here? Nope. Is there anything in here? Uh. Anything in here? Nope. 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 Hmm. We go go out that way, thank you. Jeez. Alrighty. Now to get some weapons. So we can become violent people. I will probably cut this out and I will tell you what I did. Alright, everybody, I'm back. So what we did was for Phoenix we got him a sharp saber. Which pretty much doubled his offense, offensive moves, such as the stabbing and the slicing. And Ringmail, I think, increased his defense by three. They had no shields because they're lame. Uh, Iron Circlet is better than a leather hat, apparently. <laughs> no, I know it's better, anyways. Oh, and then for Mint. We could only get her an amber cloak, and that increased her defense by three. But that's all that they had for her, so I'm a little nervous for her right now because, you know, just trying to make sure everyone's properly equipped and whatnot. And holy mackerel, I'm starting to get hungry. Urgh. I don't know what to have for lunch either because I don't want to have top ramen again. <laughs> Okay, so, after selling a whole bunch of more stuff, I was able to buy whole, let's see, I think five apple gummy bears, a few more life bottles, and seven orange gummy bears. So hopefully, hopefully, that will be good enough, so. <laughs> and we also got a pair of jet boots, so now that we run around, ha! <laughs> Ha 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 ha! It's like we're on caffeine or something. Ha! Ah. Okay. So I think I'm gonna stop right there for now. Get something to eat and then keep recording until about mm, maybe 1:30 or something like that. Cause stupid me, I left my paycheck at my friend's house. I don't know why I did that. I keep doing that at her apartment too. I don't know why. I leave something there, like my sunglasses. And now it's my paycheck. I wonder which is more important. I say the sunglasses. Because they save my eyes eyesight from the sun. Anyways. <gasps> I'm just joking. <laughs> Alright, everyone. I've had fun. I hope you have, too. And I will chat with y'all later. This is Raising Phoenix. Bye.